friends today we are going to present a video so please see this video till the end hello ma hi how are you today i'm fine so are you ready for something learn, learning something new of course yeah so today we will start with maths maths yes <laughs> so we will start with the repeated subtraction method which method repeated subtraction method yes so many children face difficulty in subtractions right so today we will learn a very simple method of repeated subtraction what is a subtraction subtraction Plus, means minus minus right subtraction means minus so today we will be doing a uh, easiest division method with the help of minus or subtraction technique okay so first i'll write down one number for you this is 34 yeah 34 divide by 2 mm, 2 it's a a small division we will be doing with the help of subtraction oh okay so the first thing you have to do is you have to first write down here 34 now you have to minus 34 because we are doing a subtraction method right mm. repeated subtraction not single time subtraction we are doing repeated subtraction method so what you have to do minus this with 20 now you will say from where 20 came yeah from where 20 came right so how you will be doing this is 2 right hmm. this is 2 so we will be doing 2 multiply by 10 equal is equal to 20, to 20. Oh. so why we have taken 10 see for repeated subtraction method what we are doing this 34 we are dividing in the slot of 10 piece we are dividing this 34 into 10 10 10 10 piece and at the end we will be getting the proper answer so i show you this 2 divided uh, multiply by 10 is equal to 20 so this 20 we are my doing minus from the 34 so now what will be the answer 14 hmm? 14 14 so now in this situation do you know in two table at what point we get 14 number yeah read two table 2 and 2 oh so i have to get the number 27 2 7 za 14, 14 right so here we got a 14 answer so 14 into 14 we got the zero so we have to do this subtraction method till the time we receive a zero number but okay. how do we get the answer now now we will get the answer from here what is this 10 and 7 10 and 7 so 34 divide by 2 is this 10 1 and this 7 Total is ten plus seven is seventeen. But how do we? But why do we have to plus the question? See what we are doing. These thirty-four things we are dividing into the slots. So that's why how many slots we have made? We have made seventeen slots. Like suppose you have a boxes. Like I have a thirty-four things, and I told you to divide it. Two 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 people. So like this, you have to make a seventeen slot to give it to two people. Oh, got it. So this is a method which you can use for dividing with the repeated subtraction method. So we'll try with the another example. Okay. So now I will give you one question. Can you do it for me? Mm, I will try. Okay. So your question is sixty-eight divided by four. This is little big number. Mm. 
so you try if you are facing any difficulty i will help you so for three four and the 40 then we do 68 minus minus 40 so our answer will be 28 does four table 28 yeah it does come mm, how many times 28 it comes seven times so 28 minus 28 equals to zero mm, four multiplying by seven Hmm. Correct. Seven equals to seven poza is twenty-eight. Now we plus this, and we get the answer as seventy. Hmm. So over here seventy. Is very it right? Very good. Very good. Very good. So now you say hmm. answers. Yeah, both the number answers are same. <laughs> now, if we have to do repeated subtraction with big numbers, like, like, uh, just take an example. One hundred. Uh, not so big. First, you learn with the little bigger number. Eighty-one divided by three. What will be the answer? Now, what we will do first? First, what we will be doing? First, we will check 81, the number 81, and then 81 minus, minus 30. 30. 3 tens so, are 30. 3 tens are 30, right? So, then what will be the balance? Is, mm, this one comes down and 5, right? 51. So, now, 51 comes in a table of 3. Mm, yeah, that, it does. It does? No, what is the last number? <laughs> sorry, sorry. What is the last number is 30. So, it doesn't come in. But why can't we continue till 30? It, because we are doing an easy method. We are not making it difficult, <laughs> right? Yeah. So, here again we will take 10. Tenza. So, here again we will minus with 30. So, so the answer will be 21. 21. Now, tell me 21 comes in a table of 3. Does come in sevens are oh. right? Seven threes are twenty one, three sevens are twenty one, right? Mm. So now we got the answer. Twenty one minus zero. Yes, yeah, zero. So now what will be the final answer now? Twenty seven. Right. This ten plus ten plus seven. So, we got the answer is 27. See, what this method means, like you, I have given you 81 chocolates. Yeah. I have three people. Mm. Okay. Ammar and his two friends want 81 chocolates. And I want to give them equally. Mm. Right? Mm. So, uh, if I want to give these three people equal chocolates, so one person... We'll get um, 27, 27 chocolates. chocolates, right? So, is this method is easy for uh, doing division? Of course, yes. Hope you understood this. Yes. Okay. So, so, friends, how do you like this method? Please subscribe our channel and help us for our target 10 lakh views.